Hey. Let me ask y'all a question real quick before we even get started with this whole shit. Okay. okay yeah. All right. Ahead. Now, hey. somebody had requested me to talk about men like men. Huh? Now, I don't knock nobody that does what they do, but thank you. I don't want to talk Bullshit. about men liking men on my show. I, we actually had a discussion with that one, Les Johnson's here. And but well, she's gay, but I don't want to talk about that shit. Jesus, thank you. Me I just shouldn't like that. Men shouldn't like that. I mean, me personally, I have seen it in my face. I've seen it on films and online and everything else. I just don't want to talk about men liking men. I just think it's so gay. And I know I'm a bisexual woman, but it's just so gay to me. I mean, just super freaking gay. I'm sorry, I gotta get it on my titty. That, that my titty. Good, oh. But I just think it's, it's <laughs> it was scratching them. I had to get it out. No, no, no. Happened? It was something stuck in there and I had to get oh, it out. And it was scratching and I said, scratch I scratched them tits for you. Scratch. But it wasn't that kind of scratch. It was like an earth eating scratch. Like, oh my God, oh, yeah, bitch, you get off these 7,000 and 400 some dollar breasts. Hello. Shout out to the breasts. Shout out to a plastic surgeon because he did a damn good job on this He did a wonderful job on my baby. <laughs> her children mm-hmm. but i'm just saying i'm not talking about this shit so don't y'all ever ask me to fucking talk about no men like men i'm just not talking about it on my show and that's why i love you thank you and then my only that i do have you know a, a, a male co-host that's here and then i have a male producer that's here i just think i just just don't think that it's unacceptable i mean it's, it's unacceptable to talk about yeah. so. there you go clap it up for the queen clap it thank up. you yeah. but we love y'all though um shout out to the game I'm, I'm not a hater i'm just not a hater just it's not just I'm not, not, just not something that i want to talk about on my show we already had that conversation okay. that <clears throat> excuse me that one in last time and then that's about it okay. i'm just not going to discuss it so please you know don't ask me the ex that i'm um, just have a topic about that because it's just just not in my thing you know that would be odd that would i mean be i like watching the movies about. i do like watching two men have sex with each other <laughs> but we're not having that discussion so we're gonna move right along got to wow. but there you I'm have just it saying. <laughs> there you have it <laughs> it's so disgusting but <laughs> Um, okay. I just think it's okay. So we can move right on along. Right. Go ahead and start this shit. <laughs> like, I just had to discuss this real quick because I just, the person asked me twice and I'm just not fucking discussing that shit. I'm sorry. Oh. If you want to go watch two men fuck, oh. you can go on Pornhub and all the other little is porn sites. Just go on just porn. Watch just if you want to know much about it. Or just Google it and find porn. out questions for yourself. Maybe some other talk shows might talk about it. I'm just not. Just no. not on our You know what? TV. We just talked about it. There you, you you there, there you go. You got it. There you go. Hop out. Hop out. Hop out. Yeah. You, you, you got your answer. You now moving right along. Moving right along. Okay, so welcome to I Want Luscious TV, hey. where you can be sure to learn the real his and her sexual size. So get your pens and paper ready. I'm um, going to take notes because us going to light you up with tips and tricks that you don't even want to miss. I just said us because, you know, it's like ladies and gentlemen and men and Woman and boy and girl, you know, what? Men lie, <laughs> right, women right. lie, men lie, Snap. women lie. You know, how they do the little poet shit and they be snapping like that. Yeah, they do. Absolutely. Snap, then, yes, yes. and snap. Hello. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. You <laughs> like that. That's a lot of work to see right Then, now. and snap. Hello. Yes. All right, so we on the show. We, um, yeah, we be here. He want to show me only talk about sex, 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 and only sex. What we talk about? Sex. Yes. Yes. Yep, so, all day. Woo! Busting right? nut. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, he's that busting nut. Gun swapping. Gun swapping. Sitting around on dick like she be spitting yeah, around twirl. on it. She 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 spitting and swallow. She's splitting Swallow. all kinds of shit. We just gonna talk about those oh, things. Okay. We just talk about sex. Honey. You wanna learn how to do that? Just um, inbox me. I can show you how to do a split on the dick. Or oh. you can call at 404-436-1277 <laughs> sure. and talk to any of us about sex. Right. Thank you. Thank you. So I am your host, <clears throat> Triple X. I gotta keep saying this X, Triple X Adult Star, Exotic Rapper, and everything else. <laughs> Luscious Kisses. I gotta say, and that. in that order. Yeah. Too much to get back all these introductions. And in that order. Shit. You gotta say all that. Hey. The only man on my show, so it's only fair to let the king go first. Of go course. Work. Go on, gang. Well, thank you, ladies. Thank you, ladies. This thank is your you. man. This is. Mr. You better not spit the rod from God. Y'all know what it is. Oh, God. You just, ooh, you just, you just made the saliva go up, all up to the esophagus or whatnot. Because I will not spit. I will swallow. That too. And in that order. And in that order. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So 
we gonna let you know my first queen or my second queen go ahead i'll reintroduce myself to it. hello guys this is miss keep the dick wet with the mouthpiece oh. miss blinking for minx miss keep it oh, slayed shit. for days oh. miss kiana motherfucking jade oh, oh, right. Right. aka miss pussy mouth I just came up with that. Okay. But she, well, she that was in prom. Something different. Yeah, she like, may say something different, but still say you better not spit. She and I've been saying my same shit for a whole goddamn year. <laughs> <laughs> this, this bitch just Google me. You want to find out some information, just Google me. <laughs> shit. Oh, well, I'm going to just go ahead and say I'm the um one of the honorary members of the Curvy Girls or like the twirl on the dick that it is. It's, it's your girl it Lisa is. Monet. Oh, yeah, honey. Oh, yes. I got a snap for that, honey. Twirling on the dick. Twirling on the dick. All the kings I mean, and queens you know, we got in this bitch. Tonight. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.
So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna I'm gonna read his light skin ass like he's a motherfucking dictionary. I'm gonna read that bitch from A to Z. I'm gonna read that bitch like he verses in the Bible. I'm gonna read this bitch like he's a fucking pergame. I'm gonna read this like you a script in a movie. So you better have oh. your motherfucking mandrels on because I'm about to get ready to slaughter your ass when I get done this shop. So we better have a diaper. He better have a diaper one, honey. Yeah, he better because I'm going to make okay. him shit on this motherfucking stuff. Make you, I'm going to make you be right. Oh, my Lord. What the fuck? This mother... Oh, my God. Missing this shit. This is like a regular... <laughs> This is every Thursday on I Want Luscious TV. Why he does falls he keep... off the chair because he talks too much shit. <laughs> you ain't even get it either. Every, I, every time he I, gets I it in with you ain't that shit happens. Happens. I should have ran over there and stomped him for DDT and me. Because I ain't over it right now. You I'm still ain't over it. You should have gave him the rock bottom of the rock People up on that. What they call a jabroni? What is that? What is that? <laughs> He's a jabroni. Hold up, though. And He's that's a what jabroni. you call. When trying to get on luscious kisses, he falls out his chair every fucking damn time. Oh, but I got your light skinned ass after this motherfucking show. All right, let's get started with the show so we can get it in. Oh, we gonna get started this motherfucking oh chit chat because I can't call a girl so because he clearly ain't no girl. So we gonna get caught. We gonna get started with this motherfucker. Oh Oh, yeah, that's sex talk. talk. Sex set. <laughs> sex set. Sex ting. No, well, we ain't even sex anymore. We're going to fucking that's talk about that, some girl um, sex. I mean, sex some with sex me. talk. It's amazing. It's right. amazing. I, so this week's topic like is, is, is about open relationship and open merge. Ooh. So I decided to do something different, you know, love and sex and relationship this uh, for the next two weeks because I just decided to do something different and we could just lay low from off of Dick's coming in your mouth and come yeah. swapping and stuff like that for a minute. You know, I have talked about it might, several it might relationship here, um, topics too also on here before. Mm. So, so I want to know True that. Yes. Yes. what are the rules to an open relationship? Who want to get started with this whole fucking topic? Because I want to know what's the rules. Let's the, yeah. the, rules? Let the man start with this oh, one. Do you know any? I've never participated in one. Uh, mm. But I would I would I, I mean, do you have an opinion? Yes. I mean, do you have a uh, like seriously have an opinion? Yes, it? I do. Uh, shit. Oh God. Damn. Okay, we just gonna come oh, back to his ass. Yeah, 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 is it clearly? That, that's it, a stumper. Right this mouth is dry like somebody dry coochie right now. <laughs> Ooh, no shit. Yeah. We got the you, 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 get that throat wet. Come on, girls. Get, get the, what get you the, think? The fucking throat. What wet do I think? Throat. What are the rules to open marriage? Well, well, to open relationship or an open marriage? Well, first. Both parties have to agree to it because True it can't that. just be one person say. And bitch, I'll be looking at my notes say. this time. Mom. I'm not looking at nothing, honey. I'm looking at the monitor. I I'm looking at the monitor, but she be looking at my notes. The devil's a liar, <laughs> <laughs> just like your little ass. Okay, so we're right, listening. Listening. <laughs> But like I said, both parties have to actually agree. This because you can have somebody say I'll do it and then they'll get into it and be like oh I don't want to do this but the fact of the matter mm -hmm. is you agree to it so mm -hmm. what is the big issue about it now that it's happening and all, all of a sudden you don't want to do it like if you want to if you want to be in an open relationship all means that's good for you and that's good for him or her because you can have two females and they agree to an open relationship. Oh wow, you're playing. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, true that. Yeah. Okay. So you ready to speak? You yes, got my your throat. Palate is wet. You, you yes, got it wet. It is okay. not wet. Yes, yes. Is the tongue wet? You better not spit. You better oh, fucking that. You better together. not spit. Got two Come on, cups. Rod from Gizzard. You uh, got two cups over there. So you better not spit. Yeah, I got all types of shit going. Work. You want to make sure he don't spit. Yeah, but I'll drink today. It's not that. We all gonna just like you go ahead and answer that question. Yes. But on what? My co host said. Mm -hmm. um, I think where it all changes sometimes is the discussions. Because mm -hmm. mind you, you two are still in a relationship, but then True. you have this open thing going on. Or and, married. Right, correct. And um, then one of you come home after a escapade, so uh, to speak. You know? okay. And then the other one is, is, is 
how can I say, inquiring minds want to know type thing. They want to know what happened. Right. And then yeah. they asked all the wrong questions, questions they think they're ready for because they agree to this okay. situation. But then all of a sudden, they ask these questions <laughs> and they find out that things happened that may not have happened with them before. Mm -hmm. This person is better, bigger, whatever the case may be. Like, because for God, that's a, that's a thing. Right. You know I mean? oh, and um, mm -hmm. and then your woman might be like, well, he made me feel a way I never felt before. This, that, never blah, blah, blah. And then it, the shit just erupts at that point. Right. So oh. what you think, um, You know what? I called you Miss Lisa. That's okay. Yeah, <laughs> I heard her say it earlier. Miss Lisa. I heard her say it earlier. Lisa, Lisa. I don't even. Lisa, Lisa, Lisa in the cold jam. Um, you know what? I kind of would agree with what she's saying. I feel like both of y'all need to be on the same page because if y'all not, if we not going into this, one person thinking one way about the whole situation, somebody's feelings can, can get hurt. Because mm -hmm. they, like you said, you might want to be like, oh, that person is bigger. It, you just, everything has, and you have to communicate. Yes. I feel like if you don't communicate, you don't know anyway, because in a relationship, you don't have no communication. There's no nothing. It's right. Dead. Like, yeah. so, I mean, oh, look at that. We have a we caller. Have a caller. Hey, we caller. have a caller. Who is We have a caller. Answer the phone. Hey. 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 Hello. Hello. Hello, caller. No. I'm calling. Wait, come on. Whoever you are, it's obviously you watching. Call back. It's obviously listening. I mean, because call he's back. my producer. He's doing you. some other things, and I really need him to be paying attention when we get some I'm callers. Because I love it when we get Ooh. callers. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that, that was a spear. Yes. The, to the hard to blink several eyelashes at him. Thank you. I need you to be on point. Yeah, and thank you. It's please amazing. call up, call back. The hate is beautiful. Call back. We will answer. We will mm. definitely want to know what you think. So yes, I I feel like that you know it should be communication going on, um, and you have to be ready. A lot of that's a lot to take on. Mm -hmm. It really like and and to speak on that, one of our watchers, Mr. Ben J said, hey, open ben relationships, Jay. open marriage. No, hell no. Okay, you can have all the communication communication in the world. Someone's still not gonna. Going to be satisfied. There's no true equal that. balance. That's true. I, 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 Shout out to you, BJ. So, let me let me Shout ask y'all. So could you, uh -huh. so could you have an open relationship without killing your merch? Mm. Shit. Um. I you, mean, like, no, you can. You can. You I can. believe you can. I believe you can because if you if you experienced a lot, experienced enough. I'll say enough, not mm -hmm. a lot. If you experienced enough, <laughs> and you just know that you're not the type of person that wants to be with one person, then mm -hmm. yeah, you, you can. Uh, but it still depends on other person. So I, don't I just think that it will kill your marriage because I just feel like, you know, um, somebody somebody's gonna get jealous. People yeah, have somebody's gonna get though. jealous. I mean, I know you just got professional. You just got professional people that's just professional like that. Yeah, and hey, professional open really. I call them professionals. They professionals. Uh, me personally, I couldn't deal with. I could. I can. I can have an open relationship with open marriage. I can't do it at all because I know on. The, I just know that he will get jealous. I'm not gonna get jealous for what? Because then the bitch ain't like me. No shade. I, I can do it quietly. And what I mean by that <laughs> is I can do it like. Are you? What you mean? If you're doing your you thing, just do it. Like not discuss. Like agree to it. But if you just cheating, that's cheating. That's an open relationship. Uh -huh. No, <laughs> like, cheating, like it or no, not. no, but cheating is definitely not an open relationship. <laughs> no, it's not, if just cheating is when quietly. Cheating is cheating. Cheating. You, you know what? You cheating know why? You know why I said is. You know why I said is. You know why I said is. Because it's not a person on earth that was cheated on and didn't know it. Your gut told you. You just stayed there. They just think they know and they don't. You know want it come sometimes a bitch just don't work. We got a caller. There we go. There we go. Hey, this this time, this, I like it. Hey, thank up. you for calling back, same person. We appreciate you. Hello. Hi. 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 You gotta turn your women. You gotta turn your background down. Just a little. Uh, it's turned down. It's turned down. Hey, it sounds okay. like, hey, hey. It sounds like he's in an open relationship. We're, We're good. good. What are you doing? Is, 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 is this Queen Kong? Queen Kong in this bitch. Yeah. You know I like this shit. Never take it personal. I'm all about my business, bitch. Yeah, this is Miss Queen Kong. Okay. Bitch. Yes. Okay, okay. 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 <laughs> 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 That's the only way you're going to get close to me if you pay some rent over here. Hello. Hello. That's the only way. Well, All right. I'm, I'm glad to be speaking, guys. I'm a hey. first-time caller, long-time listener. Oh, you know, right. thank you. Know what I'm saying? Oh, thank you. I want to end the smile. My little screen is behind, but you can smile right now. Who's that? Who's smiling? My, my name 
name is Justin. Hey, hey Justice. Hey Justice. What's going on, Justice? Well, I don't know which one you need. I don't know. What's going on, Jenny? So I was I was chiming in a little bit. I came in late in y'all conversation. Y'all conversation is about open relationships. Yeah, so it's yeah. about um open relationship and open marriage. So, you know, we, we had asked two questions, okay? So listen carefully. Uh-huh. What are the rules to an open relationship? And could you have an open relationship without killing your merch? Okay. Open relationship on the boyfriend girlfriend thing. All right. First thing, I mean, I feel the same way about both of them. Uh, no man in an open relationship should ever put the whole thing in with the side chick. Shouldn't do it. Shouldn't okay. do it. Okay. You know what I mean? Mm, because okay. y'all, with most women, I don't care how stuck out you are, are emotional creatures. And us men, we That's do true. what we do for a feeling. Right. Yeah. We do what we do for a feeling. Right. That's it. Yes, so, Someone like myself, I'm a gentleman, you know what I'm saying? But I do me, I do what I do. I'm far more most eligible black. Okay. Ah, okay. You know, How you nice doing? to your ass. <laughs> I might take somebody out the country. I might want to take somebody out the country. Okay. I might want a vacation. I, I got a passport. A I got a passport. I Work. Why? Uh, <laughs> I, 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 I got a passport, said, honey. She got a passport. I can go out the country. No, I'm talking from a single man point. I get what you're saying. I'm um, baby, go ahead. So, like, when you're in a relationship, mm-hmm. you cannot really be. You can be in an open relationship, but you got to choose feelings between one or two people. Okay. True. Somebody's gonna, somebody gonna get hurt. Yeah. That, so that is so true. true. Somebody's gonna get hurt. Yeah. Regardless. So, right. Karma, karma's a bitch. Yes, you already know. Decide on what you do. You know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Me personally, if I'm in a relationship, I'd rather go trip, spend the money. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I deal with her no more. Pay some bills. Trying to play games with somebody. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Carry two relationships. Okay. Yeah. Work. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, your person wants a month. That is a relationship. Your relationship is once a month. Right. So that person's going to get used to you, you coming to see them and treat them how you treat them once a month. Now say you're a boss up type dude, you're a boss up type nigga like me. Oh, okay. I might fly you somewhere, <laughs> I might take you somewhere, or whatever. Yeah, it might be once a month, but that's going to be that one time a month that you're looking forward to every single month. But you know, you know but you know what? I don't think there's nothing wrong with that, though. No. Like, seriously. But we got to wrap this thing on uh-huh. up because we still have a whole show to do and i really appreciate you calling and i'm and i appreciate you supporting thank you and i really appreciate you you know um for watching yes. and supporting you know i want us to tv you know this has been a whole year of this doing and Work. thank you call again okay yes yeah and I, that's why i say 10 something Maybe close to 11 12. because we appreciate your patience, bro. <laughs> Blame it on the liquor. Let's yeah, just say right, that because right. we, we get the drinks and the, the food. The show is. before us, us, the producer, we've been here playing around. We never on time. And <laughs> producer. Y'all keep doing what y'all doing. Y'all got another show. Queen Kong was nice to talk to you. Oh, thank you. Uh, y'all, have, y'all have a good night. All right. Oh, All right thanks. Call back. Okay, so well, shout out to him for you know yeah, giving us a call and stuff sir. like that. Thank so, you. I want to move right along with this topic. Okay, should they practice safe sex? Of yes. course, absolutely. Your microphone is blocking. Blocker, blocker. It can't blocker, see nobody's faces. Blocking. It's on blocker. Oh, excuse me, God. it's on. Uh, falling asleep. Got to be seen. I apologize. <laughs> 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 Damn. I mean, he's locked and shit. Locks, nigga. Move the fucking microphone. I mean, what Diamond said. You know, I'm just you know. Would go ahead. What you say I was? Uh, exactly. Right. Right. Average That's chick would go ahead. That's, That's what, what he said. said. Average chick would go ahead. Yeah, yeah, not even go or whatever. It used to be good. Uh, oh. <laughs> Lies. Oh, God. Lies. 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 Wait until after Lies. this shit is over. Let's just don't even, like, don't even feed into him. Let's go ahead. Shit, feed into it. I need to see this shit. I'm going to add to this show. Okay, so should they practice safe sex? Absolutely. Absolutely. I think so, too, because... Um, today in this world, this is 2016. Oh, yeah. It's a lot of diseases popping up, new oh, ones right. that you don't even know that you're dying tomorrow. 
Yep. This is basically, I don't even know the names of it. It could be called unga, 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 but you're dying. But I'm just sitting there yeah, saying, yeah, so you right better shit. fucking strip the unga, unga, unga. <laughs> I'm just yeah. saying. Okay, so you know, then you got A's. What and, in the world? I can't even get it out. Oh my just, god! Just, 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 he's laughing at me. I'm being serious. Oh that's that shit. That was going on. That's that's a brand. That was random. Right I'm I can't sorry. even get. It. I'm with it. I'm, I'm with it. Go ahead. Go, go ahead. I'm gonna go laugh. She need to right. patent that shit. Cause I swear, if I hear a news reporter say somebody got the uncle, 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 we we suing. Yeah, cause we I need to go on. Yeah, we need all. Hello. I mean, hello. I want to stop dancing. Hello. <laughs> 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 I need some fucking money. <laughs> oh shit! I need a, I need a million. <laughs> okay, so okay. y'all making me hot. Dom ain't no fan in this bitch. No air. I'm about to be out this shirt. I'm hot as shit. You know I'm a diabetic. Well, you know, oh, wait a minute. Oh, we can... <laughs> drink, drink for the diabetics. It's pink month, but we're going to drink for the diabetics. Cancer and diabetes, honey. Yeah. Is that kind of nice? I mean, okay. So, <laughs> this is the shout out to that. Yep. <laughs> but I'm hot as fuck. <laughs> okay. So, what if they develop feelings so this is basically what he was saying about the feelings. So, what right. if that other person develops feelings for you? So, this is basically what he was saying about the feelings. So, what if that other person develop feelings or your mate develop feelings or you develop feelings right. outside of your relationship or your marriage or this person just developed the feelings. I'm just trying to figure out what if, what if mm -hmm. it's about, it's, a whole it's, 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 it's about truth. Um, yep. that's it. It's about truth. Honestly, like you have to, have open, you have to yeah, have a communication. Open, that's right. It's, it's but, that simple. But at the end of the day, you still gonna have feelings because what if that you fall in love with that person, that person might be sexing you right or treating you right or talking to you right, mm -hmm. and they're treating you better than your partner mm -hmm. or something else. Doesn't even matter. You still gonna get feelings. At the end of the day, somebody's gonna get hurt. Just like yeah. I said, somebody's gonna get hurt. Yeah. I said yeah. we are emotional creature creatures, and sometimes we can't help that when we're getting sexed mm -hmm. that some type of emotions come about and i am guilty of it i'm Girl. guilty of getting emotional off of some dick like okay. seriously i mean i got emotional on some dick too before but no to the point where i've gone off on after the after the shit is over no, i, ain't I get a little that. emotional just for a couple. Gonna, if you just for a couple. The dick is inside me, then I might get emotional. But just for a couple, not for mm, most. I don't. I mean, it had happened no. before. I'm not saying all the time that it happens. You know, mm. I try to like put that out of my mind because you know when I was doing my thing, I just was like, okay, well, I'm selling this pussy. I can't get emotional if this dick is good or not. True. I want that coin. That coin is gonna make me emotional because that coin is making me come. Oh no, Hello. no, no. I never got emotional when it comes to my money. I'm just saying never. I have got emotional over that. Now, shit. So Trina was right. That's what she said. Yeah. Money make me come. Money make me come. Money okay. Me come. No, Trina didn't say that. Rick Ross Rick Ro said that. Well, shit. whoever was saying that. Uh, Rick Ross. It was like Trina. Money well, make Trina me come. Money, money. I know, but that wasn't Trina. That wasn't Trina. Was, was Trina. Okay. But she was in it, so I don't think money makes me come. Trina don't even matter. Makes me come. Whatever the bitch that was in the whatever. She was in the song. But money makes me come. Okay, so yeah. How long do open relationships normally last? Oh Lord, I have no idea for that well, one. Well, yeah. sorry, for the sorry for yawning, y'all. Well, let's see. That's but um, so I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. Is Will and Jada in an open relationship? They said that, but then I mean, they but said Jada, it, but Jada, Jada announced it. She said that was not the case. She said that wasn't the case. But you know, Jada did like a couple of threesomes and shit before. But then she just felt like, okay, well. But Jada was doing the lesbian thing. Yeah, yeah. but that was the rumor. Yeah, yeah, allegedly. Allegedly. allegedly, allegedly, she probably yeah, was. She, she probably, you know, she probably was. You did. And it's probably one hey, I'm gonna do awesome. anything in the world to please my man because my man ain't gonna go to the next bit. And I gotta exactly. say this for anybody that knows me, y'all know that Jade is the one. I, any any woman I've dated, I've always yeah. had to get a pass on Jada. Like, really? I can date a woman. I I can get married. Listen, I love you but to you death. You want a pass? If for I Jada? can fuck Jada though, I need that pass. Yes, fuck Beyonce, all them bitches. Jada is oh, nasty. No, 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 no. Jada what you is mean? nasty. No, Jada dirty is shame. a freak. Beyonce ain't no freak though. No, no, no. She's a freak you for her know. man. You know. She's a freak for her man. Because she's she loves her man. Jada is she just a freak. She's a freak for your man. She's down for her man. Listen, 
Why not? You know what? Give me, give me if it was second. any person, give me one second. Go ahead. Jada Pinkett, this is for you. Oh, okay. Well, if we'll ever you act up, I on. swear to God, I will suck every hole in your body. Okay, I will fuck you every, every which way hole. loose. I will it's eat anything it. off you. Every I will lick every crevice. J if he ever fuck up, matter of fact, he ain't gotta fuck up. If you just want to just venture out, I'm in Baltimore. You're from here. You can find me, okay, yeah, Jada? Oh, I swear God. to God, Jada. That's, what, that's be, my stepmom cousin, too. Are you serious? I swear to God. So there's a, there's a I, I'm not even... You know connected. what? <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, Will. I'm going to fuck your bitch. I'm going to fuck your bitch. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I can like that, Jesus. Okay. Damn, Lisa. Thirsty. Your mouth is all wet over here. Her, wet, her mouth is never dry. Her name trying? is Miss Wet Wet. Well, I just like the twirl. Hey, I know you did, and you just did. That's why I was like, the fuck is so See, you better not. <laughs> Let me find out. You really just. I just like Jay. It's okay. I really did. Like, it's okay. All right. Okay. It's okay. All right. Wow. It's okay. It, it, it's okay. Most. It's a fantasy. It's a fantasy. Yeah. So uh -huh. we've had, oh, we've yeah, had fantasies. It's a fantasy. Okay. Yeah, he's yeah, back. I'm, I'm he's back. back. I'm back. Okay. He's back. He's back. He's back. I've had fantasy. You know, sometimes you just dream a little he bit. Said, you just dream a little bit. But he's at every crevice. <laughs> you know, you got that. You come on, please. You, you know, you got that them fantasy them? guy that you be like, I will. Yeah, just a I will. I will, I will suck you like dry. I just let it go. Let it go. All right, so we gonna move right on the line. Let, let me think about that. I don't know. That. <laughs> so, I know is an open relationship is a good idea? Do y'all really think that's a good idea? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Oh, uh, as bad okay, as it yes, sounds. I mean, I, asked, oh. I I was asking a question. I know y'all still going off on your fantasies. We sorry. <laughs> you you know why I think it is a good idea? Because there are points and times on a relationship where you you just don't trust a person. Mm -hmm. So so if you had that honest communication mm -hmm. and somebody was like, listen, hey, yeah, I'm dating so and so, I'm going to do this, then I think it's a good idea. It, it comforts you because you know. Sometimes mm -hmm. you know the truth. It's soothing, whether it's a truth you do or don't like. You know, it's it's sure. just like. All right, cool. At least I know, you know. But yeah, and then I'm gonna think like, you know what? If you do have longevity and having an open relationship, it's because the other person realizes that you being in a relationship or being in an open marriage, you love that person enough to know that this person is not is allowing you to go out and knowing that you still come back. That would yeah. be the only reason why you would be like, they gotta respect this person enough to come back. You know what I'm saying? Like, you allowing me to do this and still come back to me right. kind mm -hmm. of thing. Right. That would be the only to see somebody staying in a, an open relationship for that long. I don't know. That's true. You know? I mean, because you maybe, appreciate Maybe, maybe that it's a good idea for certain certain ways, but you really got professional people that really does this on the list. Yeah. yeah. Like heard, swinging and all that stuff. I've, heard, I've heard some people say being in an open relationship, it just is better for them because there's no real it's main there's no like strings attached like they might develop feelings but they're not going to tell you that they're developing feelings because they know the rules of an open relationship and yeah that's another rule no strings attached no feelings mm -hmm. none of that shit you got to leave your feelings at the door because it's all about <laughs> getting pleasure getting that orgasm and getting the hell out I think that's where the boundaries are drawn. I think I think it's wow. a thing of okay. And coming then, back later you can on go for fuck, another round. You can't go <laughs> on a date. You can't go spend time. You can't go. That's true. But you would, but you would, you would think that it's like a, a emotional connection through all that. Like another relationship. I'm sorry. They think that the person open might stuff on loves you because the dick might be so good to them. That's and my man. So, the sex might be so fucking good to them. Hurry, doesn't matter if it's a male or female that you gonna want those things. Yeah. True. Like, true. I have one of them. Shut up. But that's that's where the open yeah. communication comes yeah. in. Right. 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 So let me ask you another question. Okay. So have y'all okay. ever been in one or convinced your partners to try one? Have y'all ever been in one and y'all have y'all convinced that your partner or have they convinced you to be in one? I've never been in an open relationship, but I've done swinging open. and I've done swinging with married couples. So they knew what was up. They told me they swing. They knew what was up and I knew what was up and I was down for the good time. So there was no feelings involved for me because I know they're married. They're never going to leave. The, each other for me mm -hmm. and i was fine with that and as a matter of fact i had just ended the relationship so i was single and i was having a good ass time so i wasn't 
the feelings was right. I didn't have no feelings. No, so that, but that's about, how but that's definitely. how I be though. But that's yeah. how I be though. Yeah. I mean, I have done a swinger thing too before, and I also was in an open relationship. I was open, I was in an open relationship with a girl. So I mean, she be like, Babe, I got this bitch over the house. Come over here. We about to go fuck her that. Oh, baby, I'm on my motherfucking way. Okay. And we would go and gang bang that bitch together. <laughs> I done that. Well, well, I, I know. I, I well, I'll be that. like, babe, I got this bitch over here. This bitch fat as shit. I know you're like, and she light skin and pretty, and you like the little light skin pretty bitches. Let's go fuck her. She'll come over there and fuck and We would just fuck the bitches, and that was it. I got another one, but I I'm used to be. I used well, to be in an open relationship with a female. I, I never been in an open relationship with a guy, but I've been in like swinger situations with but, females. But that girl, it was never an issue. We ain't never fuss or fight about the situation. Shit, why you Wait, why we break up? Because. Oh, we just two different people. We was just two different people. They weren't meant to be but together. I was diamonds. still getting my money, but we were just two different people. And, I mean, <laughs> I can't say what that person Some people is, you're supposed to be with and others you're not supposed to be in a relationship with. True. Sometimes that's you true. might supposed to be in an open relationship, no swings thing. attached type of shit. And you better hope you don't fall out that chair. <laughs> Shout out to CEO's <laughs> moving. Okay, so okay, what would you do if your okay. partner asked you mm -hmm. for one? I would try. I've been in that. <laughs> I swear well, to God, actually, I would try. I've been in that. Situ I've been in that situation yeah. with my ex, who I am still friends with to this very That's day. No, sir, <laughs> you're a hater, and right. we still fuck to this very day, and. I think that was the best thing for us is not for us to be in a relationship. Lisa Cup got a gangster one. I know. I think yeah, that was the best thing for I mean, us. I'm bringing them glasses. I got dollars. Mm -hmm. I, I think sorry, that right. was the. I think that was the best thing for us is us not being in a relationship because there are no strings attached. I mean, we still go out, go have a good time. He eat. He we eat. We fuck. Right, right. <laughs> Y'all both eat. Yes, he eats the pussy and I eat the dick like it is a Mr. Good Bar. Oh, yes. Oh. We yeah, we go out. He gets mm -hmm. he gives me birthday presents. Thank you right. for the birthday present I got this year. What you mean? <laughs> no, I don't kiss. I don't kiss. Him. I don't fall off the fall off a chair. I mean. But we actually discussed that. We've discussed mm -hmm. other people into our relationship because he's done the swinger thing. I've done the swinger thing, and we wanted to do it together. Something like a pimp. Oh. He ain't no pimp. Oh, I ain't know what that was. Me neither. I was like, son. Some new shit he just thought about. about. I don't know what the hell he's talking about. Well, me What's personally, I couldn't do it in my relationship. And, and I'm saying that... Not saying that, oh, I would be jealous of the next bitch. First of all, you know, bitch like me, no oh, shit. Okay. I'm a bad bitch in that bed, out that bed, in that kitchen, in that home, <laughs> with your children. Yes, my family's from the country. Yes, yes, I can. Go on my page. You will see all my dinners. Thanksgiving. I Christmas. Oh, we got another call. You got a call on that. I'm fucking like, you can cook. You better put some money up. <laughs> Yeah, for the phone. All right. <laughs> Did you say, why are you? <laughs> <laughs> That's not even true. She didn't tell you. I know. Did you answer? Hey, Carla. Hey, Carla. Hi. Hey, how, how you doing? How y'all doing? <laughs> hey, hey. This nigga here. <laughs> <laughs> that was so dumb. We love you. <laughs> we love you. Okay. Okay. Right. All right. So I don't know where y'all at right now, but I got something back. All right. Okay, Justin. Y'all, y'all, y'all are talking about a normal, average, suburban relationship, open relationship, swinging, and all that. Let's talk about a nigga with some bread. You feel what I'm saying? With some bread. Oh, I feel what he's saying. A no. Female, a female. Something like a rich dude. And, and Queen Kong, no disrespect. And little brown skin shorty next to you. Know this little brown skin shorty next to you. Oh, he peeped the cleave. He peeped the cleave. Wait a minute. What the hell are we about to say? Look, I'm going to listen. Listen to me. A nigga like me, if you meet me, you're going to want to be the main chick. There's no such thing as an open relationship. I can't be in the relationship. I'm 
court, if I treat you so good, it's no such thing as an open relationship. I'm not going to get in a relationship. Because y'all will be fighting to get the top twice. Oh, well, my name. Let me. Well, let me explain something to you. <laughs> all right, because my motherfucking name is Luscious. Because I ain't gotta fight a bitch to get no way. Because I do what I do. Trust and believe. I never fought anything. Yeah. Not a bitch. Not a nigga. Not nothing. <laughs> not a bitch ass <laughs> nigga. <laughs> I'm just saying. I do what I do. Because any woman I do what I do. Oh, and that's what I do. That's what I do. Don't get it fucked up. Don't get it fucked up. I'm just saying, when you know, I'm talking about open relationship. Oh, mm -hmm. love, they like, damn, I don't want to make that nigga mine. I don't want no open relationship. Okay. But that's what, but before you was calling, Mr. Justice, I was sitting there saying, that I don't want an open relationship either. Because first of all, I ain't sharing shit. Right. And two, you wouldn't want to share me. And three, and I just was basically sitting there and telling them that I do whatever I got to do to keep mine. You ain't going to want another bitch. Plain and simple. Right. Well, That's just what it say, is. You let not. Let say this, because you spoke up for the women very, very, very eloquently. Really? I spoke <laughs> up for myself. <laughs> I spoke for myself. Yeah. I spoke for myself. <laughs> If you say something, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You said get a job, then you said flip a couple more packs. How the fuck you gonna do both? I mean, you can, but I'm just saying, like, you gotta pick. I mean, hey. <laughs> <laughs> you tried that you light skin. Fuck away no nigga on the block like that. Because that nigga won't get locked up and all the money you spent on her, she'll be spending right back on herself. And then they come to So that. no. You understand? No, you want to die. Mr. Justice, what side of Baltimore are you from? I'm Baltimore serious. No, 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 no. You will not do this in my house. What part of Baltimore are you from? You just disappointed Mr. Diamond K. You just disappointed Mr. Diamond K. Oh, Eastside got the best pussy. So, Eastside got the best vagina. Eastside got the best vagina. Oh, my. I like what I got. I love what I got. I got one baby. Don't do that. One. I am done. I have zero. I ain't no kids. I don't have no kids. I'm on the west side. You know why? Oh, wow. But you know what? But listen, it's, 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 it's nothing wrong with that, okay? Wow. I'm just sitting there with saying before you got on this show. So you've been a yapping that with I ain't nobody not going to have an open relationship on me because like I was saying, I cook, I clean, I fuck, I dedicate, and I do what I got to do. That's right. And even if I don't want to fuck you, I'm going to fuck you. I'm going to suck you, but I'm going to do it. And you're going to have your meals. And, and 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 everything else. That's just what I do. I'm just not. Hey, I'm just not allowing no open relationship. You're not so, going to go fuck another bitch. You're okay. not going to want to fuck another bitch after you fuck me. Because so, my resume is here to here. So I do what I got to do to keep my man happy. So he won't have to step out. Relationship. No, you 100 percent this queen call. And let me just say this one thing. So I'm not trying to take up all y'all air time. Let me say this. Everything I mean, but you just did. Oh, stop. Huh? No, go ahead, Mr. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead, Mr. Justice. Uh, I, just want, I just want to say this one thing, Ms. Queen Kong, because for real, everything that you say, that's what a real real man is looking for. Paid or unpaid or whatever, he will kill for you if you give him that. You're 100% right. Thank okay? you. But I'm a single man. I 100% believe in tricking and all that because I get back to my business and do what I got to do. <laughs> it's just a simple business transaction. But the whole today... <laughs> Oh, today, these hoes. They gotta come out here, and when you fuck them in the morning, they have you for money, and this, that, and the other, this, this, whatever. Every, every, every month, they got a problem. <laughs> yeah. But the, a real motherfucking, a real motherfucking hoe. Right. A real hoe. Uh 
Mm-hmm. Hey, 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 Mr. Justice, Mr. It sound Justice. Like these hoes done pissed but you listen, off, right? Yeah. I think the hoes they pissed them off, but we yeah, have to let you off. go because we're running on time with the show. Yeah. But we we definitely appreciate you calling in for number two. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you did. You did. You did. All right, well, thanks for calling in, okay? Yes, Mr. Justice. Bye bye. All right. <laughs> I mean, well, damn. Yes, Mr. Justice. He worked for the He represented the trap out here, didn't he? Yeah, the yes, trap out. You need to go get some pussy. Ain't no, got too much time to on stop messing with them hoes. You know, get some pussy. Ooh, Ain't no way you need to call twice, my brother. That means Mr. Justice leaves them fucking hoes alone, alone and get you some real pussy. Get you some- Oh, if he gets you some east side hoes, you won't have them problems. Hello? Hello? Again? Get you some east side hoes, Mr. Justice. Oh, you won't shit. have those problems. Shit, <laughs> 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 we do. East side got the best motherfucking pussy. Okay, okay, word. That is the truth, okay, word. We get stalked over the east side. We get stalked over the east side. So let I me heard. just... Okay, heard. so... Murph. You know, and instead of me having, you know, my sex fakes tonight, I'm I just got to give out some luscious tips tonight. You about to work. Okay, so yeah, this work. is, okay, so y'all can also correct me if I'm wrong. Just correct me if I'm wrong. But this is some tips that I had, you know, pulled up and stuff. So this is seven ways to have an open relationship without killing it. Oh, okay. Right. Without killing him or her or it? Killing it. Killing your the whole thing. <laughs> your relationship. How about that? Your relationship or your marriage? Okay, so number one. Yes. Put it all out on the table. Uh-huh. That's number one. Yeah. Put it all out on the table. Agreed. Okay. So if you've been curious about your relation, your um open relationship, the first <laughs> thing to do is to talk over with your partners. So I mean, like you have that conversation with your partner mm-hmm. and this is what y'all both want to do. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Okay, so number two, set some ground rules. Okay. Once you're sure that you both want to go forward, make a list of boundaries that both of y'all are comfortable with. I agree with I that. I agree with that, but let me say one thing. Ladies always have this one rule. What's that? You can't come with her. What? That's why you're there. But if you like, haven't, like, but if, I mean, open relationships is y'all, y'all have an open relationship. Man, I mean, how do you know if she came or not? You can't come. What? No, that's what, like, I'm serious. Like, you can't come in. Well, her? I've never been in an open relationship, but I've had multiple threesomes. But mm-hmm. shout out to the threesomes. Yeah, no. shout out to those. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but that's whatnot. always like their rule. Fatal four ways. It's, it's, it's like Fatal. you can't. But I, I I know a lot of ladies that's like that. I guess you can call it that. Yeah. Or or yeah. is it that you can't? If like if you're doing a threesome, like the man in the. No, but listen what I'm saying. He's right. I never thought about it. But, but listen what I'm saying. That's true. I, I, that bitch. That's no, true. No, I know this. I, I know this one person who um you know actually had sex. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Well, they had, or they put the best friend in. Her and her husband put the best friend in. It's always the best friend. It always yeah. starts with that. The best friend. It, it is. And she got mad when she left and got up to the bathroom that her husband was fucking the best friend. Mm-hmm. And the rules was that she wasn't supposed. He wasn't supposed to fuck her. But she said that's all she heard was this coming back, and she looked. He was on top, and she just was looking fucking stupid. That bitch already knew she, the bitch already wanted to fuck your man. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, she wanted to fuck yeah. your man. That's what it was. Yeah. Even if you didn't have an open relationship with the bitch, the bitch had your man on her mind. Yes, she did. That's why I only brought one person around my best my man. I'm about to commit a man law violation. I What's ain't gonna What's fuck. I man? know my man. I know my I'm man. I'm about to commit a man law violation. I but my man okay. don't want nobody but me. I know. No shade. So, <laughs> None. <laughs> but I value my friendship. I don't want you this to go so viral. Like, <laughs> Sorry. I'm about to commit a man law violation. Okay, okay, go ahead. For most guys, when you when you when you <laughs> express to your woman that you desire a threesome, of course her, her comfortable zone, her comfort zone is gonna be her best friend. Okay. Exactly. So that's so that's gonna happen. Not mine. Next, Not mine. <laughs> now, mind, I'm now, no. now what no. you need to do is have your woman ask her best friend what she is completely against. Completely against. Doing a with and your then best you have to do that. I'm talking about having sex. That like, so so then once you do that, it'll eliminate her thinking that the best friend wants you. So for instance, like long story short, mine, that's what happened. My first threesome, it was her best friend. And her best friend didn't want to do anal. 
it. Okay. Fucked in the ass. Per oh. point blank. So now my girl Where's knows the, that it's fucked the best friend. I'm all that. about you. You know what I mean? Because your girl, Wait if you minute. don't, if it's all about satisfaction and you satisfy both of them, then your girl's going to want, she's going to get curious. She's going to start to get insecure, so on and so forth. You got to do something to disrespect that best friend. So find out what the best friend does not want to do and do it. Well, wait a That's minute, it. though. I'm sorry. Yeah, you did, Riley. It's okay. She just fucked her in the ass like that? Yeah, just straight fucked her in the ass. She jumped up, ran the bathroom, and I, it. it wasn't a cool. Cool. Oh, Lord. I'm just trying to help out everybody. Because I'm telling you, at the threesomes, you will get the jealous shit. And to prevent it, I I don't I you never gotta do something like, that your girl knows. Personally, I told one. you I had some, I had an open relationship, but I was always paid to be the other chick in the relationship, so I didn't give a fuck. See, yeah, you got and a I coin. Okay. Like everything yeah. is always a coin. What he's talking about? Everything is about a coin. What coin makes it different. Money makes the world go round. Money makes, makes me come. come. The fuck I just told you that earlier, right? Oh, shit. Yes, right she did. yes, she did. I All right. I heard so, it. Wasn't listening. All right. <laughs> 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 okay, so number three, don't be afraid to speak up. If you make rules, don't. If you make rules and they don't work, oh, I never got a chance to finish that one. Okay, so but I'm just saying, so don't be afraid to speak up. Say what you want, say what you like, and say what you how you feel. Okay. Just basically, you because it's something that you don't like, and you know that the person is doing it, or the person's doing it. You know what I mean? Just don't fucking do it. Just plain and simple. Okay. Don't just want to do it because your man want to do it. All men want to do it. Of man course, all men want to have a threesome. You're nasty. That's just a, that's just. Why are you look at me? Like, I know that's just an All men. I was looking at that, <laughs> but now that I'm looking at you, since you said something, you're nasty. Shit, y'all men is nasty. We're supposed to. Be. I'm nasty, right? With y'all, so it's okay. Hey, there you go. hey. There you all right, go. all right. So <laughs> I never got chance. Like I said, I never got chance to finish up. So number four. <sighs> Decide on what your comfortability. Oh, com the comfortability. <laughs> That's how <hard. laughs> Comfortability. Stay with it. Stay with it. I can't get okay. I'm sorry. I know I'm trying to twist so much. <laughs> anyway, hearing about if you're if you're feeling the need to spill every detail of your escapade about uh -huh. the. Uh, oh my god, how did I got this? But they rather, oh, but they rather keep it to themselves. So if you feel like you need to discuss those boundaries to your, don't look at my notes. I'm trying to help boundaries um, <laughs> to your partner, and they don't want to hear it. Uh -huh. Like, I just want to know, whatever, how do y'all feel about that? What like, y'all think it is it's okay for somebody to get outside of that? See, the thing is, you want open to your partner. So if the person asks, you. It's it's fucked up, but you you gotta tell them. So I'm like, I feel like if you. But this I'll be like, hey, oh my god, what y'all do? Me and this girl, and our pussy was so good, and I fucked up with a dildo. And you, but you probably be like, well, babe, I don't want to hear that shit. No, as you said, you and a girl, so we good. Oh well, nigga, I'ma say nigga, babe. This nigga with this twelve inch dick. He don't want to hear that. He don't want to hear that. As soon as you say twelve inch. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna start grabbing my shit, and and that's it. That's it. I like you. I fuck with you. We can be cool. We can be friends. But you said twelve. I'm a little short. Of that. So you know, do your thing. You can have an open relationship, body motherfuckers. That's it. That's it. That's it. I mean, when he answered that question, I'm just yeah. oh. Ooh. Ooh. And I'm just sitting there like, damn. Ooh. Did the 12 inch get you, baby? It got me. It got I'm just trying to say, maybe you need to step your dick game up, babe. I'm just saying. Hey, blame it on God. You know what? Man, God just stuff that shit later. It's that simple. It's that simple. Oh, wow. You can't pay me being an open relationship. That shit is a mess. <laughs> <laughs> it is a mess. Okay, so five. Take one step at a time. Start out slow. I'm cons considering bringing. I'm consider 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 first bringing someone else into your bedroom before you both go out on your own. I, I agree. So I basically, agree. you want to start with the threesome. Threesome, then, yeah. Yeah. So basically, you know, you start out with a threesome. <clears throat> you know, bringing somebody else to your home before you decide to step out. Yeah, because that's... still you're in an open relationship. You're not doing a threesome with your partner. But you were stepping out and had sex with somebody else. Yeah. But y'all already discussed that and already communicated about that. But y'all both stepping out and having sex with other people. Yeah. Me personally, I just couldn't do it. If I, if I was in an open relationship, it would just be, okay, well, you just bring the bitch in the bed. Understand. Another nigga not going to bring another nigga in the bed. Oh, hell no. Understand, don't want no other bitch. Understand this. This is, this, is the mo this is the 
this is the biggest problem with the open relationship thing. So like you said, due to threesome, a lot of people think mm-hmm. threesomes is big. You know what I mean? It's not. It's a minor thing, especially when you're talking about in comparison to open relationships. Some people never done it before, so it's true. like maybe big to them. That's true, but it's one thing that will, one thing that fucks it all up: the imagination. The imagination. The imagination will fuck up everything. So when you sit there and tell your guy, yeah, he made me come multiple times. Your guy, you might have came five times. He's thinking 13. You know what I mean? Like, like when you say multiple, he's thinking you couldn't hold on to shit. You was pulling paint off the wall. You pulled your own hair out. He didn't do it. You know what I mean? Like, seriously, like sit the imagination she will take you to other me. levels. The imagination you can't control. So the hairs on that's, I'm serious. <laughs> well, I'm gonna move on. You gotta sick. understand the threesome, y'all see together. Open relationship, you're just delivering the information. (laughs) We had this discussion. (laughs) Don't cheat unless your boo states that your partner wants to know nothing about who you sleep with. Remember that cheating is still cheating, even if it's open relationship. There you go. That's true. There you go. If if you're going to have it, shut the fuck up. That's it. Don't talk to me about shit. Don't come in here shaking, talking about you can't walk, bitch. <laughs> no, none of that. You better stand the fuck up. Cook that cup of noodles, bitch. I don't want to hit. I don't want to hit. Stand the fuck up. Pizza grab, and grab ginger. Something. Laying on the counter. Laying on the counter. <laughs> laying on the counter. <laughs> laying on Because if your knees buckle, oh I'm going to have God. questions. Oh I'm going to have questions. And bitch, don't get in the tub because he go already know, bitch. Why you soaking some hot water? There bitch? you go. Yep. Why you get in the yep. shower? Take it like a chief. Why you, take, why you taking your underwear you off? And, why it. you taking you your underwear off and like, putting it in the, putting it in the hair? Hurting, you better take you your motherfucking muscle relax or emotion is laid the go. fuck there. And I sweat. You better not tell me your jaws hurt. You better not tell me your jaws hurt. If your motherfucking jaws hurt, I'm gone. She better, get some, she better get some stuff. She better get some stuff for that toothache. Better do something. Like better do something. You better walk in here like a fucking school mom or something. Take some Abbas off. Hey, Terry, how you doing? There you go. That's it. That's that was it. your say. There you go. I don't care what's happening. I don't well, care what's happening. My day was lovely. Work there was awesome. And it's amazing, baby. I'm going to cook you some dinner. Because I'm in such a good mood. Okay. All right. Okay. I'll That's call you in the food. That's my baby. All right, All right big daddy. I love you. I love go. you. There you go. That you go jump in a fucking hot tub and soak a twat. <laughs> God damn it. She Clit all swollen and it. shit. Pussy looking like a fist. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That bitch was fat through your drills. Bitch, what's wrong with your coochie? You've been pumping. Let me move to number seven. Don't force the issue. If it isn't working for one of you, it's not going to work for both of you. That's Someone true. is going to get jealous and it will not be a pretty situation. No one. Just, just keeping it 100. I'm just keeping it 100. Yeah. Okay, so, I mean, that's just, you know, some little stitches in the case if y'all want to, you know, have your open relationships and I'm not doing that. So <laughs> I'm not team open up relationship shit. <laughs> Kiss my motherfucking ass. That's crazy. Basically, a if you want ago, an open relationship, thought- what's the point of having a relationship, period? You got, like point said, you got some people that's like that. You got some people that's like that open relationship and like to have fun and do different things in a relationship. I'm just that type of person that you I can't. I am one per, I'm one woman, but I'm 20 different women in one body. Trust and believe it. 20. 20. 20. God damn. 20 different. 20. 20. You competing against 20 women in this pussy eating contest. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't that about a bitch? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm every woman. woman. It's all in me. Anything you want, the baby, I, I do, do it naturally. I mean, I ain't oh. naturally, but I do it naturally, oh. though. Oh, hello. Oh, oh. <laughs> Shaka Khan. <laughs> <laughs> We need to we need to get up out of here. Even though I ain't ready to go, but we need to. You know, I still got this battle with Diamond because he think I forgot, bitch. I ain't forget. Whoa, that's good. See my Ooh. bitch face. It's my bitch face. Sorry, I ain't forget. You can't see her. You can't see her. All right, so I definitely think that I really want to bring another love sex relationship question back next week, which kind of has something to do with, you know, open relationship and uh, marriage relationships. So I want to talk about side chicks versus main chicks. Oh, hey. God. that's, whoo, Lord, Lord, Lord. That's going <laughs> to be a motherfucker right there. Ooh. 
So Call the next week for that. That's definitely, definitely going to be a topic that I think that we've never, I have never discussed on here. And I think that we should talk about it because it is love and, you know, Repeat sex that. and relationship. Yeah. And we definitely going to bring next week side chicks versus main chicks. So y'all make sure y'all tune in next Thursday for that shit because that is going to be a topic. The line's going to be on fire. Fire. Yeah. fire. We got oh to. my God. We got Ooh. to. And thank you definitely got to tell our live viewers to make sure that they call yeah. that next week on that topic. Boom, 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 and boom, boom, boom. I think that I want to start promoting that show like yeah. early. Yeah. Because we need to get like comments in and we need to get like, because I really want to know about side chicks and, and versus matrix. This is going to be a hot topic. We Hell need yeah. to bring pillows. So that means all of us is going to promote it and yes. we're gonna talk about it and whatever like shit we got, we all just going to sit and talk about it on the show because it's going to be an amazing yeah. show. Hell yeah. yeah oh, honey. So that is Give us a an amazing thing. All right, so tell the viewers where they can find you. You can find me here next week talking about side chicks versus main chicks. I can tell you that much. I can tell you that much. No, seriously. You can find me on Facebook, Tank Waddell. You can find me on IG at You Better Not Spit. I started the Snapchat. That's going to be You Better Not Spit also. I got to have it up next week. Oh, my goodness. To the ladies. He's so late on Snapchat. Hey, listen, I'm sorry. I hold up, you're going to be here. You're just saying it. I mean, you know, I know you've been busy and you shit at work that. and shit. You should do that. And, and you can find them at Walmart, too. Really <laughs> yes, you can find me at Walmart. We just had a re grand open the stores. Yeah. Tell them what the store. What I've store? been. Towson Walmart, 1238 Putty Hill Avenue. You know. Well, I live too far to go to that one. I she tried one day. She's like, I've seen her. Oh. Like oh. Yes, yes, yes. I'm there. She was in there returning shit. Now that I think about it, she was I wasn't return returning line. nothing. That that was a liar. Oh, oh, she was cashing. That, we cash checks. There you go. They cash checks and they load money onto the credit cards too. There you go. We do it all. All right, Keanu, where can we find you at, please? All righty, you can find me on iJizzy at Miss Shanae Nina. You can find me on Facebook. I-Jizzy. I'm so smart ass. You can find me on <laughs> you can find me on Facebook at Shanae Miles. You can find me on Snapchat at Shay Loves L U V S, the number two snap. You can find me here every Thursday on I Want Lush TV. I can't wait till we talk about side chicks versus main chicks. Oh, and for the ladies that want a face beating, you can holler at me on social media and I will get back to you as soon as I can because homecomings are coming up. Matter of fact, homecoming is coming up. In the next two weeks. So anybody that's going to Morgan State homecoming, holla at the kid. Okay, okay. <laughs> Diamond K, I'm about to bless that ass. Don't bless you have to you I need mean, my show. Blessing, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Your <laughs> mouth. <laughs> like John Cena, you can't see me. Oh you can't God. see me. Dirty birds. I can't wait. It's okay. I'm going to get you the store. Because I'm going to do that. Because I started some new stuff. I'm going to drop something new, guys. Wait for it. Stay tuned. Saturday, I'm going to drop something new. Because I want to make sure that I get out here and I get my stuff out there. Because I'm going to have to do that. 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 i am I'm not gonna bring that in here no more. Once you get that. Damn. Ooh, okay. Shout out Black Crystal Wine. Oh, They're that. that. <laughs> she can call my you baby. But listen, right now, she said that, but she drunk damn near the, the half of the fucking bottle. She does it. She I'm does still it. sipping one cup. I had that kind of day because I had, I had a whole, I had a whole hard day at, at my main. Oh, bless you. Thank you. But listen, October the eighth, we're gonna have a laundry party um, at the Fifth Regiment Armory from seven to one. 7 p.m. to 1 a.m. Mm. Come on, we got some parties going on, $15 tickets. I'm going to be there. You're going to see me all around. Because, listen, she got to have three or four things going on. I know it's a professional event, but somebody's going to show up and say, hey, hey, excuse me, you Lisa? Oh, can you give me tips on twirling on the dick? 
Yeah. Somebody's going to ask you that. They're going to ask you. And, guess what? and listen, guess what listen, listen, listen. No, listen. I'm going to make sure that you, I'm going to make sure that you very well prepared for that. Okay. All right. Got you. Listen. The queen will be there. Yes. yes. I'm here for it. And guess what? Guess what? You're going to see me every Thursday, though. Oh, I want to see. Yeah. Yeah. We Yes. I just said I just said that we just going to probably just change the time to 11 o'clock because we don't never get started until 11. We we always go on at 11 o'clock. I mean we still get it out 10, but this is true. Tank it late because it's working. We are now Fridays having our meeting. And the man turned up. turned up. Okay, so well with me. Hmm. Yes. Um, you can find me on IG that's Luscious Kisses Triple X. Um, Facebook, Luscious Kisses, Twitter, Luscious Kisses One, YouTube, Luscious Kisses, Google Luscious Kisses, you'll find back work or whatever the case might be. You're gonna find everything like um, <laughs> excuse me, if you Google Luscious Kisses, plain and simple. Um I just dropped my video what a mm -hmm. week ago, and that's rent, and that's what Tank yes. wanted to talk about. It's a good video. It, it is a good video. Good you video. like it? I, I, I really did like it. Thank I'm you. Yes. I really did it's like very it. Good. Thank you. That's all. I, 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 I know how to do is serve a good video. <laughs> I don't. I don't know how to serve a bad one. I'm gonna serve you body. I'm gonna serve you face. I'm gonna serve you hair, outfit, makeup. I'm gonna serve every motherfucker thing that I can. She did that. Thank you. I killed them boots. You see my boots? Yeah, I made them boots. Yeah, made I made them fucking yeah. boots. Now, what's the ones I got on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, so definitely. Um, yeah, let me show these guys real quick. Girl, show the boots, honey. Okay, so. Ran down on that plug. Hey. These, are, these are my booties. These are my baby. These are my pink ah. label fur baby. We and they come in the any boots. color, any we style, like any way you want with Sarasky crystal pearls. Anything you want. I've been making these bitches for two years now. So um I made these earn for a flop. So if you want these or anything, you can come to my boutique. That's 815 North Charles Street, um, Baltimore, Maryland. I also ship nationwide. I ship anywhere, doesn't matter where it is. I ship out. I'm also having a fifth year anniversary. I actually pushed it until December. I'm gonna have that with my toy drive because I do a toy drive every year. And I would like to invite everyone that's in here to come because I think we should give back to the children. I Diamond do, K. I know I say I'm allergic to children. I am. But I have a heart. I do have a heart for kids. I have a child. So I, I, kid. have, I have a heart when it comes to children. She love the kids. So, um, stay tuned for more information with that. I also, um, about to get ready to drop something too in December. Um, I, I actually, I think it's even November, December. Okay, so... I've been working on um, this product. Okay. Oh. So I'm going to get to it. If I can find it. Downloads. Okay. So I am dropping this product. So I'm going to show them first. You, I don't, I'm trying to see how. Can somebody Exclusive. show the camera? Exclusive. I haven't even, mind you, I haven't dropped this yet on no socials or no nothing. It's on my phone. So. Okay. I said booty. No, it's bunny. not. Booty. So if y'all see that, I am dropping my booty enhancement cream. Booty. Yeah. Yes. I know booty. Get a big booty. Get a big booty by the new year, honey. <laughs> booty, 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 booty rocking. So mind everywhere. you, I booty, just booty, booty, booty rocking everywhere. Booty, 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 booty rocking everywhere. <laughs> rocking everywhere. Rocking everywhere. Get a new booty by the new year. Get a new booty by the new year. Oh my god, I can't get it out. Y'all crazy. Okay, so mind y'all. Y'all was the first to see. Get out of my phone. Come on. It's, it's not dropping yet. No, so get out. Out. I was shitting on. Can you get that? Get the phone Can you get my phone? Is a tattoo that my sister wants. I mean, you get out of my get phone. phone. She's all in her phone. <laughs> can, you, can, you um, can you get my phone real quick, Lisa, for me, please? So, oh, okay. quarter Dusty Rose elbow at the beginning of the show. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so. 
Thank you. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, thank you. I did. I designed it myself. But thank you. Okay, so basically, I just want to give. <laughs> see, if he just saw something he won't want to see, then you'd have been mad if he went through my phone. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Get out my phone, though. I said, I'm going to give it a little bit, um, you know, a little quick little thing that I got going on with that. Okay, so it's um, Luscious Kids is Ed's and Handsome and Crane. So, ladies, if y'all want a big booty, a nice round booty, a fat booty, doesn't even matter. I have my own butt enhancement cream coming out. If you don't want surgery, you don't want the, you don't want to be in pain, you don't want nothing, and it definitely does work. And I did test it on quite a few people first before I decided to come out with this whole product. So this product will be dropping either November or December, most likely de December. But I'm- um, January, can I get one as a birthday present? Well, I want it as part of one of my birthday presents. <laughs> but anyway, I mean, it's, it is a nice thing that I got going on, and it's also going to come with um, waist, tra waist trainers and butt lifting pads and all this other stuff. So it's like a whole little thing. But um, ladies, do support that whole movement of luscious kisses. I'm just working hard and I'm branding support myself. The movement. And then, you know, then we have some other things that might be coming out too after that. I might got it coming out the same time. I haven't decided to. Diamond K was all on my phone and he saw it. Don't say nothing. But. So, I mean, we will be dropping those things. And y'all was the first today to see my booty enhancement cream. Exclusive. On I Want Luscious TV before right. I even post it on any social media. Yeah. Thank you. That's what's up. Okay, so, um, yeah, I think I'm about done here. I said about my video. Um, oh, no, I'm not. Um, also, go on Baltimore Music Awards and vote for me. I'm up for two awards this year. Uh -huh. I, I'm up for Music Video of the Year. That's Pretty Pussy. That's one of my one of my favorite videos because I was in body paint, and that bitch body paint me fiercely, okay? I mean, Coochie was itching at the, at the end of it, <laughs> but I was looking really amazing in that video. Real and shit. shout out to um, Taylor Boy Nate for, um, you know, filming the whole thing. And shout out to this bitch for doing my makeup and everything else, you know. Um, and I'm also up for eye candy of the year. I'm like, damn, I'm up for eye candy of the year too. Thank you. I really appreciate appreciate those things too. And also, um, you want to tell them about the Baltimore Music Awards, Diamond? Sure. You can tell them about the Baltimore Music Awards and what we got going on and stuff there. Thank you. <laughs> Just tell them what we got going on, you know, for the Baltimore Music Awards and uh Oh, please don't act like that. And everything else you got going on please that I'm involved. Please don't act like that. <laughs> and I wait. Finally. Ooh. Okay, I watch this shit. I watch too much rough. Who you with? Okay. You dropping the bottle? I dropped the bottle. Dropping cheese, dropping bottles. All right. So real quick, Baltimore Music Awards. Uh, the voting is going on right now. The finalists in every category are uh, on the website. These are voted on by the people. The red carpet ceremony, sixth annual Baltimore Music Awards goes down Tuesday, December the 6th at the Downtown Cultural Arts Center. Uh, hosted by Tierra Lanise. So we're doing something. This is the biggest. This is going to be the biggest event that we've ever had. It's going to start actually on Friday. We're having a uh, pre-party on Friday. Saturday, we are having a nominees and friends concert. It's going to be a live stream. Uh, so it's going to be a lot of people performing at that. Uh, Sunday, we're going to have the pre-show where me and Sweet Tea are going to run down all of the categories, all the nominees, and we're going to go through that whole thing. Uh, Monday is a Hall of Fame party. And Tuesday is the red carpet ceremony, uh, which is absolutely free. But there's a catch. You have to RSVP at BaltimoreMusicAwards.com. So there are a limited number of tickets. So if you want to go and you can go for free, you can do that. Go to BaltimoreMusicAwards.com and RSVP. Real simple. Live performances. I, I forgot to mention that. Some live performances. Uh, Luscious Kisses, K-Mac, D-Boy. And Lovely Journey will be performing live. They're going to be vendors. Uh, it's going to be so. It's going to be different. It's going to be different. Um, but it's going to be nice. Hot red carpet. 
um, and the red carpet uh, interviews and the media coverage is going to be done by Jay Jackson and Industry Weekly from um, BBC. So don't forget y'all to get y'all tickets and stuff. It's going to like be a, nice a commercial. Event. It's definitely going to be a nice event. So make sure y'all go. And everybody to say, well, I would love for y'all to come and support me. Because I am performing. Um, so I would love, you know, because y'all are a part of I Want Lushes TV. And <laughs> Of course, I'll be there. You already know people when I get out. Because <laughs> that's what I do. But we about to end this shit. Diamond, I still got you at the end of this motherfucker show. Somebody um, had a good suggestion. Not suggestion, but they thought that side chick versus main, versus main chick is probably going to take two episodes. You feel like they oh, feel like yeah. that? We'll I see. I don't think y'all realize how big of a topic that is. Yeah. I mean, we will see. Right? Yeah, see? Hey. See? Hey, the boy. Yeah. It's okay. We will see, and we and don't forget, we will definitely see. I keep saying, don't forget, don't forget. Anyway, <laughs> all right, you've been kissed by Luscious Kiss. Mwah. Tune in every Thursday on ReadyOnFire.com. It's I Want Luscious TV. I'm your host, Luscious Kisses, and make sure y'all tune in to the motherfucking side chicks versus main chicks next, next week. week, next Thursday. And this is my motherfucking crew, and we out this bitch. <laughs> <laughs>